I explained it a um, few times in the past. I tried to. It's a bit complex, but I think it's very important to try and understand that um, structure of how this world works. So there is a great light of the Creator that is coming down from the top, means from Hashem Himself. And like when we are looking at something, so we're sending our thought towards that thing. And then our thought is grasping, hitting that thing, surrounding it, understanding it, circling it, filling it, touching it with our minds, and then comes back to our mind with conclusions. So that is the process as well when Hashem is looking down to earth and seeing us and surrounding us and filling us with his loving thoughts and then according to our actions those thoughts are going back towards Hashem in that time that Hashem Hashem's observation on us is touching us filling us and surrounding us that is the time when we are standing in that time to choose. This is the present time of our lives. In that time, we need to choose right. We need to choose life. And if we are nullifying ourselves to the truth of Hashem, we listen to the voice of Hashem, we are using our good attributes, our good midot, and we are trying to be as kind, as good, as loving, as supportive, as positive as we can. By that, we are choosing right, and the light that shines towards us from heaven, from Hashem, is then going back in a straight line towards Hashem. But if the person, God forbid, is twisting his ways and bending his choices and going on crooked roads, so then the light is disappearing into the vessels, is going behind the curtains, and then darkness is falling, God forbid, on the world. Therefore, every person, no matter what, he goes through in life, which kind of challenge and test he's going through. In any one of those situations, the only thing that we need to do for us to correct that situation and to make sure that the sparks will be elevated back up to Hashem and things will go back in a straight line to Hashem, we need to attach ourselves to the truth and to be honest, and to be kind, and to be nice, and to be able to admit our mistakes, and to confess on our wrongs, and on our sins, and on our faults, and just to be able to be people of truth, to be sincere, to be nice, to be kind, to be truthful. And by that, the light will shine in great ways. I believe that the potential of every soul that feels connection from within to the Almighty is so great and enormous that is a life changing that can save lives of millions or maybe even billions of people around the world. So we just need to believe in ourselves and in that great night that we are at tonight. And if you hear that class in a different day, in that present time that Hashem sent this class to you, this is your opportunity and this is your possibility to achieve the greatest, greatest potential that you have been blessed with by Hashem, by just attaching and connecting yourself to the truth, to the Creator, that He is the God of truth and become one with Him is by saying only one thing in your mouth. And it's the thing that you have in your heart, one in your heart that will be expressed through your mouth, the truth. 
and nothing but the truth, so help you God. Thank you and many blessings and greetings to all of us. Amen. You know me, my name is RDMC with the Muna Project. All the nations with me, close your eyes, just breathe, see the truth. Don't chase the fake world, don't buy the fake news, be yourself, your own true self. Don't let no one take our natural wealth, see the good. From an endless spring, light up courage in yourself. You they free. can kick you down to the ground, hold yourself up till you are put up your crown. King of the Creator, holy soul inside. Focus on the spiritual and you shall.